What's up, Buckhead? What's up, Rainy Buckhead? What's up? All right, so now we're in familiar territory. Let's get lost. Actually, let's get lost or get a smoothie. I kind of want Smoothie King for lunch. You know, I don't think there's a Smoothie King up here. Let's go adventuring in the rain. Listening to Drake in the rain, in the rain. I'm listening to Drake in the rain. Oh, yes. Oh, that man's right. It's like in the rain. Oh, God, I'm going. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Look at the fears. So I've never been over here, you guys. Maybe once, but honestly, I don't, for like me, I don't remember it. It's like it's down one of like a bit, really busy road in Atlanta, and there's a bunch of malls up here. I usually just like stop at the malls, you know, because that's a, that's where I come up here for. But I've never come. What is that? What's that? Is that a hotel or like a um, a nursing home or something? That's kind of neat. I wonder if it's gonna like lead out to a road I know or, or the highway or something. I don't know. I'm curious. Or this could just keep going forever. Let's find out. Oh, look, an abandoned antique store. That's a baller clock. I look, it's Marta. Y'all, I really have no clue where I am. This is kind of freaky, but it's fun. You know, I like doing this. I've never officially done this before. So, turning around, yeah, there's lights. I'll be fine. Ooh, look, there's McDonald's. Then I'm gonna go straight that way, down over there. I wonder what's gonna be there. I've either found a castle or Oglethorpe University, y'all. OMG. That's a dark goddamn castle. Actually, I was there. I went there once for a um, play back in like middle school. Oh no. All right, I think I'm gonna turn around soon. It's time to go back to familiar territory. All right. See how I can see that I can't see, but I can see that I can't see. All right, time to turn around. Ooh, look, Savannah Sweets. I ain't never seen that before. All right, come on, left turn. Oh, I can totally turn left here. Next left turn. It's like I just want to keep. I really just want to keep going. See where I'll end up. But it's starting to rain. I'm gonna turn around. It's time. There's a Walgreens here. And there's a Carmax Carbine Center. And there's like Spruce. Spruce? Is that what it says? Spruce. Car wash. Oh, got the Canterbury's Fine Furniture right over there. Right, right there. Check it out. There we go. Guys, I wish I could like roll down the window and like, you know, show you, but look, it's raining. Yeah, I'm listening to Taylor Swift. What? That's what I do? Y'all, it's an Arkansas license plate. What's up, Arkansas? Arkansas! Look, even this far. Oh, you can't see it now because the sign isn't there. Okay, the sign just changed, guys. I'm a little creeped out. That, yeah, 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 that sign changes. That sign changes. Oh my god, that sign changes. You know, this, like, this, I guess, I don't know what I'm on. I guess a highway. I'm not on a highway. It said it was a highway. I'm on a, um,. On a busy street, this reminds me a lot of New Jersey where I used to live. Um, they were just like, this is all there was really there. Like, you would turn off and you'd be in like the heart of a town, but then this is like the main way, like roads like this, you know? That it's it's just very reminiscent. Reminiscent, reminiscent. It reminds me a lot of it. That's actually kind of a cool shopping center. It's like on a corner and it just looks like, I don't know. It's just kind of cool. You know, that's kind of neat. I like it. Oh, Walmart! That's not kind of cool. That's kind of lame, actually. Damn, it just lost some respect for me, that shopping center over there. Damn. I'm not a fan of Walmart, you guys. Even though I've been there like twice, I don't really like it. It just feels dark in there, doesn't it, though? It's like, it seems like dirty and dark. Dark and dirty. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, a little, I'm, I'm a little hungry right now. Ooh, Asian Pearl Buffet looks legit. Damn, you can't really see that. It looks like a boat with some, like, shiny stuff. That makes no sense. What am I saying? You don't care. You really don't. The second antique store that's not there anymore. They still have some baller-ass statues. Oh my god, look at that, you guys. Look at those. Oh my god, I really... Holy crap! Holy crap, I'm so coming back and taking one of those. Um, please, if you're watching this, I'm really not. That's so tight. I want, like, a Greek goddess for my house. What's it called? My yard? That'd be so tight. That would be so tight. So I need a pickup truck and a big and another pickup truck and a ramp and some like pulleys and whatnot. Okay, that's really tight. Damn. I don't think I just unless they're like permanent fixtures, I don't think they're really missing it because the store's not there, right? Right? So you guys might be asking yourself, Max, you're so dumb. Why? Why is like driving to a new place just or not even a new place? This is essentially where I live. Just part of it, you know? It's like, you might be saying, Max, why is it so exciting? Well, it's, you know what, you guys? And I say to those people who say that, try driving somewhere. Like, if you, you basically, whenever you live someplace, you have, like, the same routine you do, and you have, like, the same, like, boundaries you will go where you live, you know? Like, you're like, oh, I'll just go up to the mall, but you never go past the mall. Like, I'll just go to that, I don't know, supermarket, but you never go past that supermarket. 
I guess this can be like applied to, you know, like other things. You never go past. Anyway, but just try something. Like literally just go drive somewhere and like not even get lost. Like just stay on a main road, but drive somewhere you haven't gone before. It's really tight. I mean, it's like a, it's a cathartic experience almost. I don't know. It's just like you don't know where you're going. You have no idea what you're going to see. And you're not like lost or in danger because A, you're in your car and B, you're on a giant main road. So you're not going to get lost. But it's a lot of fun. I really, I think it would be kind of cool, you know. I might want to start doing this more. I mean, there's, then there's also like smaller side roads, which I know if I take like, you know, side road, eventually I'll hit something that I know. So I might want to try that next. But for today, this is all the adventuring I'm going to do. And also, and also on a side note, I love, I love, as you guys probably remember me saying, but I love days like this, like rainy days, like where it's overcast. It's cozy, man. I'm just saying. It's very, very cozy. And especially if you go driving on these kind of days, this makes the experience that much better. Unless you love the sun, it'll make that experience that much better. I don't know. Anyway, so I'm getting back to close to areas that I know. The fun adventures come to an end. I'll miss your adventure. There's a Nathan's hot dogs over here. Oh, my God. Nathan's. Oh, roosters and that's an... I'm gonna get some ice cream and a hot dog, Shotty. That's what I'm gonna do. Giant building here. Um, apparently, if you look back there, it's like a um little like shopping plaza, shopping plaza. Um, and I'm hoping that that might be my next adventure that I take, whenever that may be. Next week, next month, not next year. That's too long. Oh God, look, there's a deer. Holy crap, do you see that, guys? There's a deer over there, like a deer part with a bunch of dogs and stuff. That would be so cool to check out. I might want to do that. It's like I just moved here, you know? That's what I'm acting like. F it. I don't give a damn. This is what I do. Just makes fun. Make, make fun things. Oh, that sucks. That's really bad. I'm so sorry, ma'am. Or sir. I think it's a ma'am. Okay. So, fun fact. Did you know Smoothie King started in Hawaii? Or by Hawaiian. Steve Kunahu. I'm guessing that's a Hawaiian. Anyway, this is a medium. This doesn't look like a medium. This looks like a large. I asked for a medium. I didn't want a large. Excuse me. I don't think I can have this all. Would you guys like some? Don't eat my smoothie. I'm acting very weird today, guys. I don't know why. I apologize. I apologize. Okay, check it out, y'all. This sky looks ominous as rocks. Let's just be honest. Like, oh, damn. Look at it over there. Oh, damn. You can't really get the the real gra you can't Show grasp behind it. Us. Behind, you us, see us behind us, you see behind us. That's like relatively normal. So it's, I mean, that's overcast. But then we look over here. It's just nasty. And then we look over here. <sighs> and it's just like straight ahead, just like darkness. Not really. You can still see, but still. We're, I'm with Catherine and Jane right now. I forgot to tell what I'm doing. Jane's sitting in my sweatshirt, which is not cool. No, no she's she's like I'm just gonna sit on Max's sweatshirt and she's like plop. Well, anyway, that's whoa TMI, Jane. TMI. Anyway, what movie are we seeing, Catherine? She's out of your league. She's out of your league. Thanks. That's so nice of you. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. Yeah, we're seeing a movie, and then we're gonna eat after. We had a big dilemma about that, so I'm excited. I'm so pumped. Probably can't see me. Well, you might because there's some light. But we're in the theater. We made it. It's not that packed. So phew. It was a stressful thing. It started raining again. I'll show you after the movie, but it's probably gonna stop raining by then. Because it stopped raining by now. So anyway, I'm pumped. I'm hungry. I want food. I'm gonna get some food. Alright guys, so we're having a debate. Now, is She's Out of My League, the movie I just saw, so I have to check if I was feeling, is the movie She's Out of My League, is that considered a chick flick? Like, does that seem like a chick flick to you? Because I thought that was more like a teen comedy-esque movie. But I guess, I mean, I'd, even after seeing it, I still think it was a teen comedy, but some of the people I was with, um, they think it was a chick flick. I'm, I'm a little confused. Did I just want to see a chick flick? Ah! Even if I did, oh well, so what? But anyway, I liked the movie, you know, it was actually, it was, you know, predictable. It wasn't anything new, didn't add anything new to the genre, of whatever it, the genre is. But it was, it was very entertaining and pretty funny at parts. And hey, I loved it. Except I had to pee, okay, TMI time. TMI time, I like that. I had to pee really bad twice for some reason. I think I had too much water before I went, but I had to, seriously, like, I could, like, usually, I'm, you know, you can hold it. I couldn't hold it. It sucked, guys. It sucked. So, I don't know. There's my TMI. Going to Charlie's house now. Going to hang out and just chill. My last day spring break. Spring break is over in an hour and a half for me, you guys. Summer break is soon, though. Fuck yeah, summer vacation. Ton of tunes, how I spend my summer vacation. All right, got to drive so I don't die. It's so foggy out.